The U.S. Marine Corps and state police are continuing their mission of helping needy families during the holidays. This weekend, they kick off their Toys for Tots campaign with Stuff the Cruiser. Brian Wilk joins us in the studio with more. Brian. That's right, Jennifer. State police and the Marines are inviting the public to join the annual mission of providing happiness, hope, and the joy of Christmas to local children in need. Tuesday morning, state police and Marines kicked off their Toys for Tots Stuff the Cruiser campaign. Now in its seventh year, their mission stays the same. This event, I think, is important every year, and it's especially important to be able to help those families who may need a little extra help this year to still give their children a nice Christmas. This is what makes it so rewarding to be a part of. As the nation slowly recovers from the pandemic, plus a spike in inflation, the cost of toys has increased for families already facing financial hardships. With the nice weather, it seems more and more people are in the mood to get out and donate. And people around the community just seem like they're ready to get out and uh, be a little more open to volunteering and helping out. Why is it important that police and Marines are working together? Part of our job is to serve, right? So in service, what you want to do is help the community the best that you can, and any opportunity we have to serve, uh, we'll look forward to helping the community. There are already over 2,300 kids signed up. November 20th is the sign-up deadline. They're asking for unwrapped, nonviolent toys for either boys or girls ages newborn to 14 years of age. And Stuff the Cruiser will be Saturday, November 5th from 12 to 4 over at the Summit Township Walmart store.